Hey, what's up everybody? My name is TJ. We're gonna be playing Five Nights at Freddy's 3 again. You guys gave me a lot of tips in the comments on the previous videos on how to play this game, and you requested that I give another shot. So, uh, because you guys are awesome, and you gave me some awesome tips, and I really want to give it a shot, here we go. We're gonna try, we're gonna start a new game, and uh, I also looked up some stuff about the mini games. Apparently there's, there are clues in the end of the level mini games that help you achieve like the good ending. I don't know if we're gonna get the good ending or not. I'm gonna try my best. It looked like Nights 4 and 5 minigames are like really crazy. And you have to go back and play the minigames multiple times in order to get the good ending. So uh, we're gonna just see what happens. Hopefully we'll actually just play the game as it's supposed to be played, which would be exciting. So thank you guys very much for watching. Here we go, new game. Let's get into it. In case you don't know before, this is not a pizzeria. This is like, uh, this is an amusement park, a horror amusement park where they have relics from the previous Five Nights at Freddy's, from the previous Freddy Fazbear's. Okay, I don't need to use my left hand. I don't need to use my left hand. All right, night one is usually pretty easy. Hey, hey, glad you came back for another night. I promise it'll be a lot more interesting this time. Found some, some great new relics over the weekend, and we're out tracking down a new lead right now. So, uh, let me just update you real quick, then you can get to work. Like, the attraction opens in like a week, so we have to make sure everything works and nothing catches on fire. Uh, when the place so this guy's talking. Pretty much just nonsense, uh, but basically saying that you gotta get this place ready. What I'm doing right now is analyzing the map. We are here. This room is a room near us. That room is like what we can see, I think, through our window. This right here is like a walkway, and then you get into that room, and then you're right here, right? So, uh... Um, anyways, if you, if, so like, the playing audio thing, you're supposed to use it on the rooms that he's right next to. I don't think he's even released on night one. Uh, so right now I'm using night one to just get familiar with stuff. You gotta kind of analyze this stuff apparently, so you can recognize where Springtrap, the guy's name, character's name, where he is in the room, uh, and because he sometimes he hides inside the rooms and it's hard to see it anyway. So if you gotta, you gotta be like more familiar with it. I think uh, that has but, to do know, with like stuff said, later on. We're trying to track down a good lead right now. Uh, some guy who helped design one of the buildings. And, and I don't like think that there's any mini games on the first night. I could be wrong. Like but I don't so think so. We're gonna so. take a peek and see what we can find. Uh, for now, just get comfortable with the new setup. Um, just get comfortable with the new setup. Check the security cameras over to your right with the click of that blue button. Uh, you can toggle between the hall cams and the vent cams. I might have to use my phone uh, to pull up the mini game stuff. Left, I should probably just go ahead and have it. No, yeah, we'll wait, we'll wait. Anyway, sorry, I'm like, I'm, I'm up in my head. And you, uh, you gotta, when you double click to seal a vent, you gotta wait for it to actually seal up first before you click off of it. And then you only reset the things when they're actually needing. That. So. Okay, keep an eye on things, and we'll try to have something new for you tomorrow night. Oh man. So I think you mostly stay on this area right here. If you see one of the hallucinations, you should try and change the camera first before putting it down. Uh, because if you put it down, it will probably jump scare you. If it does jump scare you, go ahead and reset the ventilation. Because it usually sets, when you get jump scared, it like hurts your character in game and it usually messes with the ventilation. I got all these tips in my head from you guys and from this couple websites that I was looking at, so. Alright, so we got one room here. If he's in front of us, we should take him to room five or two. And then hopefully to three, or this one right here. Camp. These are cams, not rooms. I th apparently one of those has to do with the mini game. I think cameras like nine, eight, and seven. 
and six have to do with a mini game as well? I don't remember. I don't remember. All right, we made it through the first night. Big whoop! I don't think you can even die on the first night. So that was our homework session. Here we go. Now the game really begins. That was the mini game. Okay. I think we use Wasid. Yes. Okay. Some dude's gonna show up, tell us to follow, but there's clues if we go the opposite way. So we're gonna go the opposite way. I think this is the machine shop, closet, something like that. Um, if you go down here, follow me. That was the purple guy. Can't quite see. That's the stage, You probably. If you go to the West Hall, which I think is just straight down, there it is, right there, on the left. All right, and the purple guy just went down. So on the left there, it says B, B, D, B, L, click. And apparently what it stands for is Balloon Boy Double Click. So you've got to find Balloon Boy, and you've got to double click on him. He's somewhere Balloon Boy. I don't even know who Balloon Boy is, uh, but I will find out. That was the clue. Balloon boy, double click. And there was like a bunch of party hats, I think. Was that right? Oh, that's a, oh, that's another clue. The one on the right. It's it's the same. They're apparently they're cupcakes or something like that. It's four cupcakes. Top left, bottom left, top right, bottom right. And that's the order you gotta do it in. When you find those four cupcakes, wherever they are, which I think is the next night. You gotta, you gotta go find them. There's the fan. Hey, look, it's the office, like where we are in the future, but yet also right now, but not really right now. Um, so you gotta click it in that order wherever you find the cupcakes. Oh man. Okay, we can just go ahead and end this mini game now. We got the clue. It's really just having the clue. After that, you're. That's it. I'm gonna go ahead and pull it up on my phone though while we got some time. Uh, yeah, you die anyways. <laughs> if you didn't know that, you probably just got freaked out. Um, five Nights Freddy's Three. Uh, come on, work with me. Quickly. Hey man, okay, I have some awesome news for you. First of all, we found some vintage audio training cassettes. Dude, these are like prehistoric. I think they were like training tapes for like other employees or something like that. So I thought we could like have them playing like over the speakers as people walk through the him? attraction. Dude, that Is that him? Is that him? Feel legit, man. But I have an even better surprise for you. And you're not gonna believe this. We found one, a real one. Uh, uh, uh gotta go, man. Was that him? Uh, well, well, look, it's in there somewhere. I'm, I'm sure you'll see it. Okay, I'll leave you with some of this great audio that I found. Talk to you later, man. Ventilation. Uh, hello? Hello, hello? Uh, welcome to your new career as a performer slash entertainer for Freddy It Saturday. moved him away. Uh, these tapes will provide you with much needed information on how to handle slash climb into slash climb out of mascot costumes. Right now, All right, so when it when it goes super fuzzy like that, it's usually because he's like changing locations. There he is. All right, so he's in the far room. So that's good. You just kind of keep an eye on him. And then when he moves, you got to find him again. And you got to take him back away. All right, video error. Making sure the animation no idea what I'm doing. Children are for maximum entertainment slash crowd pleasing value. To change oh. the animatronics to suit mode, okay. enter and turn firmly the hand crank provided by the manufacturer. Turning the crank will recoil and compress the animatronics. All right, we gotta find. Around the side of Wait, we gotta we gotta do the mini game. Schnikes, where's the mini game? Is that Balloon Boy? All right, I did it. Okay, cool, we did it. This is the mini game. And the puppies are like freaking out. You gotta collect all the balloons. There's eight balloons, but there's not really eight balloons. There's only seven in this room. And apparently there's like an invisible exit. Oh my goodness, that was the invisible exit. Holy Toledo's. Okay. But apparently there's an invisible exit in the top left, and that's where you go, actually. 
We're gonna do it. We're gonna go for it. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. We got time right now. Oh my goodness. It's crazy. Night one is a breeze. Night two, the process. Go to camera eight. Double click on the balloon boy. Left to right. Once you do, you end up in the minigame. Get all the balloons, but don't go through the exit that appears. Instead, go to the top left and jump out of the blue box. Here we go. We're falling. You'll hit a bottom that looks glitchy. Okay. Walk to the right. You'll find some sad kids. The final balloon. Okay, we're going to the right. Get down, puppy. I love you. Get down. Oh my... Holy Toledo. Past the kids. Past the crying kids. Okay, we're walking past the sad crying kids. Do we, do we come back to them later? That's so creepy. That's so creepy. I just spit everywhere. Eventually, you'll walk into the room with the last balloon. Grab it, you'll end up back in the original game. Okay. Little platformer action. I love platformers. Now, when you're back in the original game, you click on camera seven, and that's when we do the cupcakes. Okay. Supposedly, it's cupcakes. All right, and then we have another mini game. All right. So, we're going to get the final balloon here. Here we go. It resets. Oh my goodness, we have to do that again. Okay. Uh, it reset the night, but we did the mini game. So that's a somewhat small accomplishment, right, guys? I don't know what that thing is on the left. It freaks me out. Um, camera seven. Is this it? These things right here? That one lit up. There they are. There we go. Okay, so that was them. You could see them flash a little bit yellow. That's, how would you know to do this? Alright, Fo Mangle's Quest. Oh, you gotta pick up the different parts, right? Yeah, there we go. You have to collect the pieces without the character in green shirt touching you. Again, ignore the exit, jump out of the purple box. Another glitch. Make your way to the cake. Alright, here we go. Okay, so there's a character in green who's gonna like try and come and kill us. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Do I have to just like avoid him to the left? Alright, we're gonna do it again. We're gonna do it again. All right, fine. We'll do it again. Whatever. Doesn't matter to me. All right, let's go. Let's go to the right. We can do it again. One, two, three, four. All right, here we go. So I, I thought I was safe because I was on top of it. Apparently, you're not. No one is safe from. Okay. 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 Nope. 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 Okay. Okay. It's really hard to see, like, the bottom of his platformy things. Okay. Oh, lordy. Don't touch me! Okay. Yo, that dude. He's so happy, but he's just not... Oh, he's got no chill, though. Okay. Quickly, go! <laughs> Quickly! Okay. Okay, we're good. Don't go in the exit, remember? Do not. Do not. We're gonna go this way. Oh, that's not. Mangle, you look weird, bro. Okay. Okay, we're going. Peace! <laughs> Whoa, okay. Are we still missing a part? Oh, that looks like a kid crying. Okay, we're gonna go to the left this time. Question mark? Walk to the left. Okay. Guides. They're fun. They're cool. Alright. So balloons now. Make your way. Oh. Balloons lift you up. Check that out. And upwards and more to the left. Okay. Just don't <laughs> fall off. Okay. The cake. Alright. That's, that's an important thing is getting all the cakes. Okay, we did it. 
Back to the second night. We still gotta beat the second night. Here we go. Okay. Um, go back to Balloon Boy's mini game on camera eight. Collect all the balloons. And do this, the same thing. Camera eight. Balloon Boy. I actually legit, legit did not know that Balloon Boy was on camera eight or whatever, or that he was on the wall. Just literally happened to like see him and be like, that looks like a boy with like balloons over his head, etc. Like, proud of myself making that connection. That was all me, baby. All me. Why is his pur why is his balloon purple, I wonder? Okay, can't go out on the right side. We gotta go to the left side. Oh, don't hit the exit door. Okay, we're going out. You gotta land on a balloon, is that right? Okay. Alright, landed on the balloon. Go to the right, you'll find another cake. Okay. Platforming action! It's the best type, man. I love- what- Platformers are the best, man. I'm gonna make a platforming game someday. Oh, poor kid! Don't- uh, I'll get- Here's a cake! For you, kid. Please be happy. Alright, so did that- did that work out? I guess we gave him a cake. Okay, so now we got, oh, the, uh, is that new? That's old, that's old. All right, so now we got a beat night two. This is a straight up guide, I'm on Kotaku.com for this one. This is actually one I didn't even see previously. So now we got a beat night two. And then, uh, oh, did I just click off of it somehow? That was weird, right? I just tried to click. 10, but like it minimized the game for me, but yet we're still playing. Usually when you minimize it, it like quits the game for you. So I'm not sure if I should be creeped out. Is that anything? If I should be creeped out. Or if we're chill. Alright, where is... Is that spring trap right there? I can't tell what it is. Spring trap. Spring trap. Spring trap. Spring trap, where are you? Spring trap. Uh oh. Ventilation. Yeah, where's spring trap though? We haven't even seen him this game yet. I don't feel good about that. Haven't heard anything in the vents though. I'm like somewhat nervous actually. Okay. Not good. Not good. Getting a little nervous. Getting a little nervous. Haven't seen Springtrap all game yet. Hope I'm not like skipping over him somehow. Honestly, don't know where he is right now. Is that... Okay. That was a bit of a jump scare. I think I saw something there. I'm not entirely certain. You're cool, bro. It's cool. Be cool, bro. Be cool. I don't know where he is. Hands are getting sweaty. Spring trap, oh spring trap, where are you, my dear? Whoa. Spring trap, oh spring trap, come near me, my dear. Not sure what that was actually that one right there. Map toggle. Spring trap. Bro! Jump scare. Jump scare. It's chill. It's chill. We'll just do the ventilation real quick. It's cool. We're good. Get down, baby. I love you. I'm about to go put y'all in y'all room. The puppies are 
pawing at my legs. I'm like, bro, it's not right now. Not right now, huh? Not right now. Alright, you're supposed to click on a different camera when that happens, and that... Is that him there? I feel like that was kind of him there. Since we haven't seen him all game, let's go ahead and play Hi. audio in that room. Somewhat central room, right? Legit don't know where he is. Oh, shh, Nikes, what does that mean? What? Oh my goodness, he's right there. Oh, g goodness. I'm dead. I'm dead. I just saw him peek. We're dead, right? Uh... I think you might be able to draw him away. I doubt it, but you might be able to. What does that mean? Man, no, he's like right there. Unfortunately. So you gotta stare him down, you gotta like freeze. So he's right there at the left, see him? Apparently if you freeze, there's a chance he won't kill you. 4 a.m., I don't think we're gonna live. Oh, we gotta do it. We gotta do it. Puppy's quiet. Well, couldn't find him the whole game. Hey, no, get over there. I'm gonna put you guys up. I'm serious. I'm serious. Don't mess with me. How can you mess with this? How can you get upset at this face, though? How can you get upset at this face, though? I can't. I can't. I can't. Okay, that's gonna be it for the first part of this. This is our second playthrough of Five Nights at Freddy's 3. Uh, I'm going to cut it right here, and then when we start back up, we will have, uh, we'll go back through uh, night two again. And I'm going to put the puppies up because they're going crazy, and they're making me nervous too. All right, uh, thumbs up if you appreciate this and want more of this, or you like this, you like this episode, you like, I don't know. I, I, I just want to say thanks for giving me tips on the videos, so hopefully this will work out well. Alright, you guys have a great time. I'll see you later on with more episodes. Hey, stop fighting. Stop fighting, I tell you. Alright, bye. Hey, puppies.